Hey guys, you here for Easy Scarlet Keep Cheeses. This works on all difficulties of the strike. You can save a lot of time by cheesing the elevator. To do this, you want to send the elevator up, then walk far enough away so that you join allies. This will put you at the next level, way before the elevator makes it, giving you more time and avoiding some enemies. Do this quickly before enemies spawn downstairs. They fixed the wizard bug so you can kill them before the elevator goes completely up without getting soft locked. Just wait for the crystal to spawn and destroy it. For the next floors, you want to send the elevator up by killing the wizards, then quickly go underneath. Activate your jump once you see joining allies so you don't die from a fall. Standing on the lower walls also works to wait out the timer. Do this all the way up. When you get to the top, kill the wizards. At this point, there are two cheeses. This no-wipe cheese is designed for every difficulty except Grandmaster. In the back you will see this pile of bones. Make sure to go to this one. You can crouch in the corner and wait for your teammates to complete the strike. Just look around and swap weapons so you don't get kicked for AFK. This will give your teammates unlimited time to respawn themselves if they die and finish the strike without wiping. You can shoot and help out too, but if you do that you can get shot and aggro enemies. I don't recommend it. If you are going for 100k next week and are still underleveled, this can help your team beat it without wiping. Another method that works for all difficulties and great for Grandmaster is the top ring. Push through the gate as soon as the boss comes in. You want to jump from the doorway to the middle sections. This will allow you to shoot without much aggro. There is some invisible geometry you will find, so you will need to head glitch the boss. The knights seem to be the only real threat. You can jump around to get a better view of the enemies that like to hide. Also, shooting around can draw them out of cover. If you fall down, don't worry. Just don't die to fall damage. Jump on the middle wall, jump to the side doorway, then jump back up top. If you need to go back into the map, you can find a joining ally spot to the side. Activate jump when you go down this area to slow your fall. The farthest edges are not easy to land on, so avoid those. Just be careful, and you should beat it without a problem. Cheese forever, Guardian.
Paris. It's over. Hash Ladoon is dead. This is a relief to hear. But Hash Ladoon's presence is no coincidence. The Hive must have grander ambitions for the Pyramid's influences. Return to me. There is much to discuss. 